Every child is an artist. The problem is staying an artist when you grow up. As for me, I was lucky enough to have such an inspiring family, people who create beautiful things from their minds. They created my passion for the arts, and they helped me be who I'm meant and to be. Arts and crafts all the time. Friendship bracelets, we used to make those all the time. We used to make Palmer Clay statues all the time. And we danced together up until last year. Everything we used to do was creative. I used to get you reams of fabric. You loved to go to the fabric store. And then I would come home, and when you were even four years old, um, you would have paper cutouts that you would make little dresses out of. So um, I couldn't sew, but I gave you every opportunity for you to sew, so you were creative that way. We were constantly doing arts and crafts together. We were painting, we would draw, we would go see um, anything musical, and dance. Um, pretty much anything that we did together was creative. See your sketchbooks and anything neat that you made, you would always bring it. And I'd be so excited. Like I always knew that you were gonna have some really cool, neat thing to show me that you just did, and I was always so excited for you. I think the two of us have that same kind of energy and creativity that just, we connected right away, I think, from the beginning. Well, I think our enthusiasm as a family, every time you would come, every holiday, you would have something awesome for us to show, either show us or something that you made us. Uh, did some crazy line dancing at the pool, at the family pool this summer. I was teaching you some of those dances from the 60s when I was a teenager. So one of my very favorite memories um, was preparing for Kelsey's wedding, which is happening in a couple of weeks. And we all sat around the table and we were all singing together. And I gotta tell you, it was probably my favorite memory like of all Shank Christmases. So I, I love being with you guys. I was totally a dance dad. And, you know, I sat at dance for two, three, four nights a week for hours, you know, taking you there and sitting and, and watching as you grew and, uh, watching you know and and doing this <laughs> but uh you know i absolutely supported it by by taking you there and watching you and your friends as you grew and uh and i loved it i loved being a part of your life and you know and dance is your life so uh I absolutely uh was part of that having a family full of artists is a privilege and they create an environment for me to grow their support and love helped me get through the tough days and all the way into dance school to help me continue to grow creatively. We have everyone in the family is an artist. My father draws and creates amazing things with metal and all kinds of crazy stuff. Lexi's an artist and on my mother's side they're all artists. I think My father always had a camera, I'm a photographer I'm growing up. I would always steal the camera from him. I think as a family, you know, Lisa's into art, Laura's into art, and I was taking photos. I think some of it may have rubbed off. Uh, yeah, I have Lexi loves to draw, and we have lots of needs and uncles that are very talented with drawing and creative in sewing. Uh, dancing, we don't have any dancers. We did have an, an acrobat. That was me. <laughs> You have a very supportive family. Um, we all love you, we all support what you do. You're, you're a dancer, your sister's a singer, your mom's an artist. I mean, it's, it, it's in your blood. And I feel like we all love watching you do it. We've all encouraged you to do it. And it's, you shine, Sam. I mean, your mother's an artist. I never thought of myself as an artist, but you know, I am a writer, so we're certainly I guess, right brain people. My family isn't only inspiring to me, but I've also had their unwavering support to pursue my own career in the arts since the day I realized that's what I'm meant to do. You're absolutely making the right choice being a dancer. Absolutely. Every choice you make in life is the right choice, and you're going to be extremely successful at whatever you do. Hey, Thank you, Sammy. Absolutely, 100% hands down, no questions about it point of this life while we're here is to figure out what makes us tick and what makes us happy and the art is what makes you happy it's what makes you tick it makes you Samantha it makes your face glow and it makes everyone around you happy it's you know to sit behind a desk or work 40 hours a week and not have a purpose and a passion that's not what this is about um, you found what makes you happy and you're gonna go after it and you're gonna succeed and um, I can't wait to see how it goes. 
you are making the right choice in pursuing a career for the arts. But it's going to be, a, it's a hard choice, it's a hard life and you have to have the passion to back it up and the love of what you do and I know 100% that you have that because it's, like I said, it's who you are, it's in your blood and we're all very proud of you because we know you're going to be a superstar. 100% Samantha. You are an incredibly beautiful person and your creativity and your energy and what you give out to other people, everyone sees it and feels it. It's all around you. You just push it to everyone. This is what you need to be doing. I've been to every single one of your shows and I've seen you grow and I've seen you do what you love to do. Uh, I also love seeing you reach for the stars and doing something that you love. I love dance because it's the only art form where the artist gets to also be the art. Because of my family, I not only get to be an artistic adult, but I also get to create and be living, breathing art for the rest of my life. And that's amazing. I couldn't be more thankful for my family and who they are.